Special Offers Creating Standard Offers To make a special offer in your EPOS, it's very, very simple to do. If I go on to sales mode, as you can see, I've set up two example products here. The first one is a pound, the second one is two pound. So I'm going to make an offer first that says buy three of those for two pound fifty. All right, so we're going to close that and then you go to special offers on the main menu here. At the moment, we don't have any special offers. So what we're going to do is we're going to click create new offer. In the top, this is where you would give the, the offer a name. Write the name as nice as possible because it's going to come up on the receipt if they print it out. So we're going to say example offer buy three for £2.50. Underneath are four different settings you can use depending on the type of offer you're going to give. So the first one would knock off a certain amount of money. The second would reduce the total to an amount of money, regardless of how much the items are. This is the one we actually want for this type of offer. The third one would knock a percentage off the total of the items. And the fourth one would make the cheapest item free or a percentage off. So usually you'd use 100% for that one. So if we click on discount total to an amount and the amount we want to reduce it to is 2.5. It's a standard offer and it applies to all stores. So just click tick. And that creates the offer. Okay, our next job is to next instruct the computer what items this applies to. So you click edit items. And here it says quantity needed. So just click that and say how many do you need? Well, we need three of any of these items on the right. So I'm going to click add products. And I'm only going to do this top one first. So three of any of these, you don't just have to do products, by the way, you can do a whole category or manufacturer products. Uh, and if you've got a lot of them and you want to search for it, you can use this filter there as well. You don't need to save or anything like that. It's automatically saved. Just click close. And whenever you make an offer, always test it. So let's close this. Let's go to sales mode. I'll just maximize that. And then what we're going to do is we're going to press example product one. So it's come up in the cart for a pound, which is what it is, but it's actually gone in orange. So this means it's potentially part of an offer. If you click it again, two pound, but when you click it a third time, it automatically knocks off 50p. And as you can see, the total is now two pound 50. The color turns to purple to tell you that, that these items are now subject to an offer. You can only have one item go to one offer at a time. So, one item cannot belong to two offers in the cart. If you click the black bar here, it will actually show you what items are currently involved in the offer. So what offers are currently involved in the cart and how much it is being subtracted from the cart's total. Okay, doesn't matter what order you put them in. You could uh, put two items then another order, and then a third one. Uh, or you could click on that one and change it to three. It doesn't matter how which way you do it, the offer computer will always give that offer. So to press exit, special offers. If you want, let's let's change this now. So let's say that uh, let's change its name first. So we're going to say buy three, get fifty p off. And what I'm going to do now is I'm going to say edit items. I'm going to add another product to this, so people can mix and match whichever they want. This one. So it's three of any of these two. And we're going to change, instead of discounting two, we're going to discount by 50p. So we're going to try a different type of offer this time. Press close and let's try it out. So you could buy three of those. That's fine. You could buy three of those and get 50p off. That's working too. Or you could mix and match. So it's completely up to you. And that's how you would do a standard type of offer that either discounts money or reduces it to a certain amount and so on.